Hi, my name is Eddie Floyd or John Floyd. I'm here to discuss some of the things with cu customer service. Uh, and we're going to show a few videos which will be on telephone customer service. Hope you enjoy. Of course, the best part of the game, somebody's got to call. Hello? Uh, yes, is this Jim Dandy, customer service? Uh, yes, yes, this is. How can I help? You know, uh, can you hold for just one second, please? Sorry. Come on, come on, man. Uh, I can't believe we missed it. Jeez. All right, sorry about that. How can I help you? Um, yes, I placed an order with your company. When my, uh, my order arrived at home, there was some things missing that I was still charged for them. So I need to let's resolve this somehow so I can either get a refund or I can get my purchase sent to them. Uh, yeah, okay. All right, let's take a look here. Uh, so something's missing, you ordered something wrong. Uh, no, I ordered that? it correctly, but they did not send it. Oh, okay, okay, so, so you ordered it for the wrong shipping date is what you're saying. No, I ordered it correctly for the right shipping date, for the right item, and your company did not send it to me. All right, all right. So let they're me billing me. Okay, let me take a look. Just, you know, calm down, calm down. Let me take a look. All right. Uh, what what did you say your name was again? My name is Miss Floyd. Okay, Miss Floyd here. First name, Marietta. All right, I, you know, I'm not there yet. Hold on one second. All right, what's your first name again? Mary Etta. Mary hyphen Etta or all together? Not a joke. Um, all together. All right. All right. So what were you calling that again? The missing items from my order. Have you got a supervisor, somebody I can speak to? Uh, hold on one second. He's not available right now. I'm going to be the one that's going to be able to help you. So, all right, so you got a missing item here. Uh, you know, which one was missing? Because I see everything was shipped here, and, uh, you know, you ordered. What was it you ordered again? Well, I ordered three pair of shoes, and only one pair came. I ordered four pairs of shorts, only two pairs came, and I ordered three sets of pajamas and didn't get any of them. Well, I show them all here ordered and shipped, so uh, they're probably lost in the mail somewhere or something like that. You know the, today's mail system. So, That's a little bit short. Let me, uh, I'll, I'll tell you what, we'll take a look at the tracking. We'll get back to you in like three days. Excuse me? But you know how it goes. Sometimes, you know, we, we people have been hiring a we're a little short staffed, all that stuff. So we got some new new folks on the line. So, uh, you know, it's gonna take a little bit extra time. Well, it needs to, get to the, needs to get resolved or you have lost my business. And I order from y'all quite frequently. I'll, I'll tell you what, man, we'll, we'll get back to you when we get back to you. We're, we're gonna try our best and then uh, we'll try to get back to you. Cause it looks like everything was sent here. But like I said, it's probably not our problem. It's probably something with, uh, you know, post office or something like that. But, but definitely, if something's our, our fault, we'll, we'll get back to you. Hi. Hope you enjoyed the first skit. Uh, a big thanks to my wife and my brother, uh, who actually come in all the way from California to do the video. And we met him in Maryland. But anyway, uh, as you saw, he was not active listening. Uh, he was not showing... Uh, any type of empathetic listening and he did not use the seven C's of communication which is you know specifically clear concise concrete correct uh, cohesive or coherent uh, complete and courteous as we uh, discussed this in the second before the second one you will see hopefully his customer service will be a lot better enjoy Jim Dandy Clothing Company. This is Rich. How can I help you? Yes, Rich. This is Marietta Floyd. I placed an order with your company, and when it came in, part of my order was missing. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that, Mrs. Floyd. Uh, 
Let me take a look and see what I can uh, look up for you and identify the issue. What is your order number? Yes, it is 999-2953. Look here. Okay, yes, I see your order here in front of me. Uh, and which item was missing from your order? Well, I ordered um, three pairs of shoes and I only received one. I ordered four pairs of shorts and only two of them came. And I ordered um, some pajamas, three pairs of pajamas, and none of them were in the order. No pajamas. Okay, all right, all right. I'm so sorry about that. Um, let me take a look at this order and uh, see what I can find out here for you. Okay. Okay. Thing now. now, I do see that all of the items that you mentioned were ordered, and, and I am so sorry that uh, that you did not receive everything. No, I am seeing here that it looks like they were on two different ship dates. Uh, one of your orders, your uh, shoes and one of the shorts, as well as the pajamas were on back order at the time, and they shipped the next day. Turn that down. I'm sorry. Turn oh, that down. Oh, that's okay. Your son sounds so cute over there. <laughs> oh, yes. He loves his cell phone. <sighs> so it looks like they're going to be arriving tomorrow. And I apologize that okay. the order was uh, separated and you only received that part. All right. Generally, I get an email. And for some reason, I don't know if it was spam or what happened. I did not get an email informing me of that this time. So that's great because they had already billed me for the items I just hadn't got them. And usually you receive an email. You know, I am going to follow up with the uh, system manager to make sure that, uh, you know, it's not an ongoing issue. Okay. Uh, I know we usually try to be really good about our customer service, so I apologize that it did no, not uh, communicate effectively this time. Okay, that sounds great to me. I sure appreciate all your help. And your name was Rich? Uh, my name is Rich, and okay. I appreciate your help. So thank you so much, uh, Mr. Floyd. And again, I apologize uh, for the inconvenience. And um, we'll be shipping you a 20% uh, discount coupon uh, in your email. So thank you I so like much. I like that. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Take care. All right. You too. Bye-bye. Bye. That was a nice one. Hi again. I hope you learned from those uh, scenarios. Uh, very proper and very adequate uh, customer service skills. Uh, the phone, even though you're not physically in front of somebody, uh, your body language that you possess affects how you handle uh, customer service and customer service repeat customers are by far the most inexpensive customers to obtain.